Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I'm Sarah the Brick. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa received today at Sakhir Palace His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa and His Royal Highness the Crown Prince Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Premier Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa as well as a number of senior officials. His Majesty the King reviewed with their Royal Highnesses a number of local affairs and topics expressing thanks and appreciation to them for their continuous efforts to establish the components of comprehensive development and improve the performance of governmental institutions to achieve the highest competitive levels of excellence and high productivity. His Majesty hailed the successes Bahrain achieved and its progress in various developmental sectors, affirming the importance of adopting the approach that supports plans and initiatives that fulfill citizens' aspirations and achieve further gains for the kingdom. His Majesty the King also expressed appreciation for the efforts of Bahraini competencies in various fields and their leading achievements that aim to raise the kingdom's regional and international status. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa was welcomed upon his return home by His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa. His Majesty the King had visited the Spanish capital Madrid when he met former Spanish monarch His Majesty King Juan Carlos to inquire about his health, wishing him abundant health. His Majesty King Juan Carlos expressed sincere thanks and appreciation to His Majesty the King for the visit and noble sentiments, wishing His Majesty the King abundant health and happiness. His Majesty King Hamad also attended the conclusion of the 2019 Ironman 70.3 World Championship held in the city of Nice, France, with the participation of the Bahrain Endurance Team and athletes from various countries. Upon arrival, his Majesty was welcomed by the mayor of Nice, Christian Estrosi, senior local officials and senior officials from the High Organizing Committee of the 2019 Ironman 70.3 World Championship. Then his Majesty the King watched part of the competitions. The representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Work and Youth Affairs and Chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, briefed His Majesty King Hamad on the participation of the Bahrain Endurance Team in the Championship, as well as its preparations for such a world sporting event. On the occasion, His Majesty the King expressed pleasure at attending the World Championship and lauded the solid relations of friendship between Bahrain and France, especially in the youth and sports fields. His Majesty also congratulated Bahrain's endurance team for winning the first and second places in 2019 Ironman 70.3 World Championship, praising their determination and distinguished levels throughout the event. He also hailed the numerous world titles attained by Bahrainis at various championships and competitions, citing His Highness Sheikh Nasser's winning of the Ironman World Championship 2018 in the U.S. His Majesty the King stressed his unwavering keenness to provide all kinds of care and support for Bahraini youth in order to continue achieving successes and maintain the kingdom's sports accomplishments and gains. His Majesty King Hamad commended the tremendous efforts exerted by His Highness Sheikh Nasser and the first Deputy Chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports and President of the Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa, to boost the march of sports in Bahrain, diversify games and encourage Bahraini youth to participate in them. His Majesty King Hamad praised such world sporting gatherings, noting that they represent platforms to strengthen friendships and cooperation among world athletes and youth. His Majesty the King wished all the competitors further success. His Majesty had earlier paid a visit to former Spanish monarch His Majesty King Juan Carlos to inquire about his health and to wish him abundant health. His Majesty King Juan Carlos expressed sincere thanks and appreciation to His Majesty King Hamad for his kind visit and wished His Majesty the King abundant health and happiness. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa attended the closing of the 2019 Iron 70.3 World Championship which was held in Nice, France and in which a Bahraini endurance was represented alongside athletes from across the world. His Majesty was greeted upon arrival by the Mayor of Nice, Christian Estrosi, along with a number of senior officials and representatives from the Supreme Committee that has organized the tournament. Following this, His Majesty watched a part of the tournament's competitions. His Majesty the King's representative for charity work and youth affairs and chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, briefed His Majesty about the participating Bahraini team. His Majesty expressed pleasure for attending the Ironman competition and praised the close Bahraini French ties, especially in the field of sports and youth affairs. His Majesty congratulated Bahrain's endurance team for winning the first and second places in the 2019 Ironman World Championship, praising their determination and distinguished levels of performance throughout the event. His Majesty hailed the numerous world titles attained by Bahrainis at various championships and competitions and referenced His Highness Sheikh Nasser's winning of the Ironman World Championship 2018 in the U.S. 
His Majesty stressed his unwavering keenness to provide all kinds of care and support for Bahraini youth in order to continue achieving successes and maintain the kingdom's sports accomplishments and gains. His Majesty commended the great efforts exerted by His Highness, his Highness Sheikh Nasser to boost Bahrain's sports profile on the international stage as well as His Highness's efforts in diversifying games and sports that are practiced in Bahrain and his encouragement of the Bahraini youth in participating in them. His Majesty also praised such as world sporting events and noted that they represent platforms to strengthen friendships and cooperations among world athletes and youth. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa issued Edict 19 of the year 2019 establishing the National Committee for Information and Population. The Edict establishes the committee presided by a Cabinet Affairs Minister with the representative members of the following government entities. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister's Court. First Deputy Prime Minister FDPM Office. Cabinet's General Secretariat, Ministry of Finance and National Economy, Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Ministry of Interior, Ministry of Education, Ministry of Industry, Commerce and Tourism, Ministry of Health, Ministry of Housing, Ministry of Works, Municipalities and Urban Planning Affairs, Ministry of Justice, Islamic Affairs and Endowments, Ministry of Labor and Social Development, Ministry of Transportation and Telecommunications, the Ministry of Youth and Sports Affairs, National Oil and Gas Authority, Electricity and Water Authority, Economic Development Board, Central Bank of Bahrain, Information and E-Government Authority, Supreme Council of Women, Supreme Council for Environment, Civil Service Bureau, Survey and Land Registration Bureau, the members will be named by the Cabinet Affairs Minister after they were nominated by their respective governmental entities. The rank of a representative must or member must be not less than the rank of an assistant undersecretary. The committee shall have its rapporteur, who prepares uh, for its meetings and edits its meetings of minutes of meeting as well as follow-ups to the implementation of its decisions. His Royal Highness, the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa received the Moroccan ambassador to Bahrain at the Rafa Palace, where His Royal Highness greeted the ambassador upon his appointment to the kingdom. During the meeting, His Royal Highness congratulated the ambassador for his appointment and said that he looked forward to further cooperation between the two countries. The ambassador, for his part, congratulated His Royal Highness the Premier for the UN's designation of the 5th of April of each year as a day of conscience. The ambassador expressed pride in this achievement by Arab leaders and said that the Kingdom of Bahrain has become an active member of the international community thanks to the vision of His Royal Highness, which is based on principles of uh, pragmatism, clarity and responsibility. As such, the ambassador said that Bahrain's endeavors contribute to world peace and stability. His Royal Highness praised the deep-rooted bilateral ties, which he said are based on the common affinities between the leaderships and the people of both countries. His Royal Highness said that Bahrain is keen on developing the bilateral ties even further in the service of both countries and people. His Royal Highness praised the role that Morocco plays in the Arab world under the leadership of His Majesty King Mohammed VI, wishing Morocco further progress and prosperity. For his part, the ambassador expressed gratitude for His Royal Highness's efforts in developing the bilateral ties and affirmed that Morocco is keen on constant cooperation with Bahrain in all fields, especially in economic and commercial matters, while citing the progress and development that Bahrain has experienced in all fields. The representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Work and Youth Affairs, President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, expressed thanks and appreciation to His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa on the occasion of His Majesty's attendance of the 2019 Ironman 70.3 World Championship held in Nice, France, and His Majesty's honoring of Bahrain Endurance Team for its historic achievement of winning first and second place in the championship. His Highness Sheikh Nasser affirmed that His Majesty's attendance affirmed his support to the youth and sports sector, noting that His Majesty's presence increased the determination of the team members. His Highness also hailed the positive results achieved in the championship and then winning first place to affirm the kingdom's high status in Ironman championships, wishing all success.